Hey you, yes you, the person sitting in front of your computer right now. I want to ask you a question. Now, if you're not from Nitrotype, this probably does not apply to you, but to a lot of people watching videos, it probably does. I can understand doing or spending one hour a day on typing, on Nitrotype, doing races. I've done that before, and that's what I'll usually do when I'm active. 50 races a day. Or these days, I'll spread that out over different websites. But on Nitrotype, that's what I do when I'm on a normal active day. Two hours a day on typing, that's like, you know, a hundred race session. Still, it's not that bad if you're really efficient with your points, you can get more races done within that time. Three hours a day. Still, at the same time, that's, that's not a lot of time to spend typing. Maybe you're doing 200 races a day, fitting that in for that amount of time, I'm not sure. Now, what if you're doing 400 races a day or 500 races a day on Nitrotype? That's probably spending about six, seven, eight hours in front of your computer. I'm not exactly d doing the math and I'm not really interested in getting into the math on that question. What if you're someone who spends basically all their free time doing a thousand races a day on Nitrotype? That's, that, that's your whole day, okay? I want you to answer me this question. Why is spending more than an hour, two hours, or I guess three hours would be the cap max for me spending a day typing? Why is that beneficial to either your speed or something else that I'm not figuring out here? When I was like starting out on an trip, of course, the more races I did, I think the faster that I would get. But at that level, spending that much of time, that much time out of your day on Nitrotype, you're not seeing improvement in speed. No one who's doing 500, 400, even 200 races a day is trying to do that to increase your speed. That's not something that someone who's trying to increase their speed would do. Like, if you're doing like 100 races a day, I can see you're doing that because you want to increase your speed, but over that, it's just unrealistic. You're still going to be able to increase your speed just as much not doing as many races. Okay, maybe it's the first day of the season and you want to do like all the races to get all the achievements. I can I can understand that. Maybe during events, you had to do like 2,000 races a day to unlock all the achievements. Sure, maybe maybe for one day you can do 2,000 races during the day, and I would understand that. But for you to do, let's say 200 races a day, or up to 500 races a day, day after day after day after day for a month, two months, three months, four months, five months, piling upon your seasons. What are you getting out of that? Because it's not, and I know it's not an increase in your typing speed. I know it's not an increase in your typing accuracy. I know you're not just doing it because you want the night trip cars. I'm seriously asking you this question. I have not figured it out in my brain yet. Why are you spending that amount of time of your day on a typing website? Maybe I can understand this if you're like starting out learning like Dvorak or Colmac. I can see myself spending maybe five hours a day max if I really wanted to learn a new layout. But people like, I love shoes too. I guess who isn't that active these days? But say like Wildflower, who's still in like the top 20 and who's been racing like basically for most of her day for her whole life. Like what are you getting out of Nitrotype? You're not getting speed. You're not getting any like achievements or anything. You've already unlocked everything. All you're seeing is that daily number tick higher and higher and higher. Now, the only thing that I think I could really think of on the spot here is like you want to improve your season ranking. But at the end of the day, what is a season ranking going to give you? Is a season ranking going to give you like a boost in your self-esteem? I don't think that you would want to do like a thousand races a day to try to win a season just because it's going to give you a boost in your self-esteem. Now, I know there's a few typists who can probably name here like Nano Nitrotype who do that amount of races. And I'm asking you this question. Why do you race that much? It, you can increase your speed. I know this is kind of a ramble. You can't get any achievements out of Nitrotype. I'm still trying to figure this out. On Type Racer, like for example, Keegan, who watches my videos occasionally, why do you do three? Why have you done 300 races all time when you're basically getting nothing out of it? I know, sure, like, okay, 300 races total. That's a ton of races. Maybe you can justify it with your speed, though I don't think so. I think that even if you did like an eighth or a 16th or a 32nd, if that's a thing, of that amount of races, your speed would probably be close to the same. So to you people who spend two hours, five hours, I don't know why in your right mind you want to spend more time typing a day on any typing website for any purpose, I want to understand why you are doing it. 
And this is kind of my question, I guess, to people who are spending so much time in typing. I'm someone who is all for spending a, amount of, a daily amount of time increasing your typing speed. That's what speed typing is kind of all about with all my typing tips and everything. But I'm seriously asking this question because I have not figured it out myself what mental drive people have to want to do that amount of races a day just to get something that I still haven't figured out. And I don't think that a season ranking is sufficient enough to want to motivate you. So if you have an answer to my question, if you're someone who does more than 200 races a day, 200 races a day is still like quite a few. And if you've been doing that for a long time, please answer my question down in the comments below. What motivates you to do that amount of races a day? I cannot imagine that myself. Um, thank you for listening to this six minute ramble about lots of race on Nitrotype. I'll see you in this next video. This is Speed Typing. Type on and type faster.